What is up, Instagram? It's Mike from Balls of Fury Ball Pythons. Welcome back to the Ball Python Bando. Today I'm coming at you guys with my top 10 reasons why you should get a ball python. And let's get started. So I'm gonna do a countdown from 10 to one. For reason number 10, we got the inexpensive to buy. So you can get a normal ball python for as low as $20. And if you wanna get something cool that looks different, there's tons of morphs out there that you could choose from. And they range anywhere from $100 all the way up to tens of thousands of dollars. So it just depends on what, how big your budget is. All right, let's go to reason number nine. Reason number nine, my gut, is they're easy to care for. Now, ball pythons, care requirements are much less demanding than a lot of other pet options out there. Also, if you travel a lot and you, you have to go on business trips for more than three to five days, ball pythons are fine with that type of lifestyle. You can easily care for one and keep it healthy with that type of lifestyle as well. All right, number eight, we got easy to handle. So ball pythons, they're pretty slow moving animals. They also really don't move a ton. They also move slowly. So this makes them easier to handle than a lot of other types of animals that can be squirmy or fast. And let's get into reason number seven. They get big, but not too big. So let's say you wanna get a pet snake, but you don't wanna get something that's gonna get ginormous, but you still want something that'll be impressive when you show it to people. Ball pythons are a great option for this. Males typically range from three to four feet as adults and females typically range from four to five feet as adults. And a five, five or six foot ball python is considered a massive ball python. So that's pretty rare if you get one that gets that big. So let's go to six, thousands of morphs. Like I was talking about earlier, guys, there are so many different morphs and different colorations of ball pythons out there. They're so polygenic. They're really exciting to get into if you're trying to become a breeder in the future. And there's so many different morphs you can work with. In my opinion, and my advice, you should work with the ones that you like the most and the ones you're passionate about. So let's get into number five. They only eat once a week. So unlike a lot of other pets, you don't have to feed your snake every single day. It can go seven to 10 days without eating as a baby. And also when it's an adult, you can feed it every 10 to 14 days. Uh, also ball pythons, sometimes they tend to fast. So these snakes can go long periods of time without eating. So always feed your ball python if it's willing to eat for sure. So number four, they don't make noise. Most other animals make some sort of sound, whether it's barking, meowing, or bird chirping. Ball pythons don't make any noise, they're silent. So you don't have to worry about them disturbing you when you're sleeping, or if you have a baby disturbing the baby, that's another great thing about ball pythons. Reason number three, they're docile and calm. Most ball pythons are pretty calm. They can be a little bit jumpy as babies, but they came out really fast once you build trust with them and work with them. They're really easy to handle and they're just an awesome pet to just chill and watch a movie with or watch TV with since they don't move around too much and they're relatively calm. Reason number two, they make great first pets. So ball pythons are great for teaching kids responsibility. They're easy to take care of so your kid really can't mess up that badly with taking care of it. That, like I said, they're not as demanding as like a dog or a cat. And it's also a great educational tool to teach your kids to respect all animals, including snakes and anything that is considered bad or scary. So reason number one, they're flat out awesome. Guys, I'm telling you, once you start buying ball pythons, once you get one, you're gonna buy more. They're so addicting. They're flat out awesome. They're so cool. I love them. And I think if you get one, you would love it too. So I hope you guys enjoyed my top 10 reasons why you should get a ball python. If you did, go ahead and comment. Follow us at Balls of Fury Ball Pythons. Join the recessive gang. Go check out Fury Tips videos. If you need to get tips on how to care for your ball python or if you're thinking about getting one, go check those videos out. There's some good tips in there that'll help you get started. So peace, guys. I hope you enjoyed.